Hey guys, this is Anand speaking back with another video. So in this video, we can see how to calculate the returns from LIC schemes. The LIC return can be calculated with three components. One is the sum assured, the other one is simple reversionary bonus, the other one is final additional bonus. So how we can get to know about these bonus values and how we can get the final calculation, we'll see in this video. Website of Life Insurance Corporation of India it's licindia.in so here under the products menu just select insurance plans so you'll get to see the list of plans offered by the LIC for example purpose let's take this LIC's new Jeevan Anand plan this is one of the most uh, popular plans in India so this plan offers uh, both the whole life protection and uh, it gives the endowment option also so that means you get the money back and also you'll get your life covered until your death so this page gives a summary of the benefits so it says on death you'll get 125 percentage of the sum assured or 10 times the annualized premium at the end of the policy term if the person survives then you'll get basic sum assured simple reversionary bonus and the final additional bonus if you see the other links here there is a illustration page let's look at the benefit illustration page so this page gives um, a sample scenario so here in this example the age at entry is 30, policy term is 35 and the basic sum assured is 1 lakh. For this combo the annualized premium expected is 3165. Again this premium may change depending on whether you are a tobacco user or not and various other conditions. But I have found something interesting in this table. So basically this table gives uh, for every year the amount of premium that you have paid so far and then uh, what is the guaranteed benefit uh, after every year so it also lists down the uh, bonus that's getting accumulated every year if you see there are two scenarios given and the scenario one is uh, calculated with four percentage uh, return on the sum assured and the calculation two is done based on six, eight percentage expected return on the sum assured basically this bonus is calculated as a simple interest of certain percentage on the sum assured whereas the sum assured is here 1 lakh so the interesting point is whatever number given here that's completely wrong and there is no number such that 4 percentage of that number is 400 and 8 percentage of the number is 3200 so this whole table is goofed up and it's completely wrong for your information 4 percentage of the sum assured 1 lakh is 4000 rupees not 400 rupees and 8 percentage of the sum assured is 8000 rupees not 3200 so this calculation is completely wrong so we cannot rely on this i'm wondering how lic can do such blender on their uh, website but anyhow so we have to calculate the premium to be paid and also how the bonus is calculated everything we have to see so let's look at the premium calculator given by uh, the lic itself here you see premium calculator link so you click on this link then you select plan that you want to choose so in this example we're going to see LIC's G1 Anand here it is new G1 Anand 815 select it and then uh, let's take the example of 25 years of age and let's give the term as 35 and some assured let's take 10 lakhs so the premium calculator works perfectly fine I guess so here the yearly premium is 27,282 and if you do it monthly it becomes 2325 rupees so this is how we can calculate the approximate premium that you're expected to pay then let's look at the next component bonus so bonus anyhow the LIC is not giving proper illustration so then I had to look for uh, other uh, useful websites for calculating the bonus so I got to know about this website online lic.co.in so this website gives a pretty decent calculator for all the LIC plans. So let's check out LIC's Jeevananan calculator. Yeah, here it is. It looks to be a good website with a lot of different calculators and very easy illustration. So this page contains again all the details of the plan, but we are interested in uh, the bonus calculator. So the age I'm selecting is 25 and the term I'm selecting is 35 as given in the premium calculator the coverage is going to be 10 lakhs let's see what this page gives us here it is 
it gives the same yearly premium 28,282 and here is the benefit illustration perfect benefit illustration uh, no though not 100 percent perfect i'll tell you the details so it gives you the illustration for your age up to 100 and also it gives the final benefits let's look at the table from the top so you're at the age of 25 and first year premium is 28,282 uh, so we are concerned about this only for accident and death coverage you have to pay additional premiums which we don't want to consider right now death coverage is 12,98,000 rupees okay so here um, let's look at the bonus component the bonus component is 48,000 why 48,000 because this person whoever has designed this calculator has taken 4.8 percentage as the bonus uh, rate so he has calculated as 4.8 percentage on the sum assured. Sum assured is 10 lakhs. So it becomes 48,000 rupees. And if you notice, the bonus for all the subsequent years is like adding 48,000 rupees every time. So he considers every year the LIC declares 4.8 percentage as the bonus rate. So if you consider this natural death coverage, it comes as 12 lakhs 98,000. Why? Because the death sum assured is 12 lakh 50,000, and then you add this bonus. So 12,98,000 is the death coverage at this point. So it goes on like this. Every year, uh, 48,000 bonus is added, assuming 4.8 percentage is the bonus rate for that year. And the policy ends after 60 years of age. So after 59 years, you would have paid up all the premiums. So at this time, the total bonus that would have been accumulated is 16.8 lakhs. And uh, your uh, Death coverage is 12.5 lakhs plus the 16.8 lakhs, 29.3 lakhs. Just note that the 10 lakh coverage continues on because as per this plan, you have the whole life cover. So after paying the premium also, till your death, you'll be covered for 10 lakhs. And you see this maturity benefit, it's 49.8 lakhs. And the lifelong insurance coverage after maturity is 10 lakhs. And let's see how this 49.8 lakhs has arrived but before this so this bonus rate I said it's he has taken as 4.8 percentage every year but LIC declares this bonus rate at the end of every year this may not be 4.8 percentage for every year it really varies so how to calculate the bonus rate or how to get to know the bonus rate declared by LIC again go back to the home page so here if you see customer services under that you see the bonus information link on that and you'll see the list of links for every year so every year LIC declares the bonus rate and it may vary if you see the last year 2014 and 2015 so this kind of uh, declaration is made by LIC at the end of the year at the end of the financial year basically so they declare bonus for every thousand rupees sum assured if it is 70 that means seven percentage you can consider okay so where is our G1 on plan new G1 on here it is new G1 on plan and if you see this is the term our term is more than 20 so that is 35 years we have selected so it, this has to be our bonus rate so this is 4.9 percentage so for the year 2014-15 the rate of return or the bonus rate is 4.9 percentage again it it's different for every year it's calculated based on the profit that LIC gets and then let's go back to that table so bonus is clear now premium is clear now and then we have to see how this number is arrived 49 lakhs 80,000 so for this we need to consider something called final additional bonus this maturity you will get at the age of 60 after paying 59th premium maturity is basically the sum assured 10 lakhs plus this bonus 16.8 lakhs plus something that's final additional bonus so how to know the final additional bonus again LIC declares every year what is the final additional bonus for every plan how to know that I didn't get any link from LIC India page so I got the information from some other website and again I got the information only for the year 2012 I didn't get any other uh, data but anyhow you can consider the rate as somewhat similar for every year so this calculation is done based on two factors the duration for which the policy has run for and the amount of sum assured 
when we started at the age of 25 and when we become 60 the term is basically 34 years and the policy would have run for 35 years so here it is 35 and then what's the sum assured it's 10 lakhs so any 2 lakhs and above is this column so basically this is 2300 2300 for every thousand rupees of sum assured and our sum assured is 10 lakhs and that becomes 23 lakhs so if you go back to this label the final additional bonus is 23 lakhs when you add this to the bonus and then 10 lakhs sum assured you will get uh, 49 lakhs 80,000 so this is how you calculate the maturity amount of this new G1 on the LIC plan so it's basically sum assured plus accrued bonus plus the final bonus this is just the sample of how you can calculate the returns that you can expect from some LIC insurance plans so the same kind of uh, illustration or the same kind of calculation we can do for other schemes also so hope uh, you would have understood like how we can expect or how we can calculate the returns of uh, LIC insurance plan so based on this you can make an informed decision whether to go for a specific LIC plan or not hope this video is helpful for you thanks for watching see you in my next video